A blessed morning, one and all. This is your apostle, Elijah Peter Chambers. Once more, with a pounding word. Hallelujah! A harsh one, and also an intriguing one. And our topic is my story put behind bars for speaking thus said the Lord and this is our 82 82nd series and our theme born hallelujah to win winning glory be to God on a perpetual and constant basis praise be to God I heard that there are individuals who are bashing at me saying that how I did not respond dead to the St. Thomas call. Praise God. Hallelujah. Fine. We've been talking about all these evil that is upon the land. We have revealed that our, uh, that our clergymen and the politicians, they, these are the folks that are a part of it. So I don't have anything to say or to address this thing. Praise God. Because when I came out in 2020 and spoke the hypocrites, the false brethren, the false prophets, and the false prophecies, prophetess, say that God did not spoke. You're gonna want to hear this voice. Hallelujah! But no more. So hear and catch what you can. And the Bible, the scripture text says in Matthew 24, 6, verse 3 to 8, and he shall hear of wars and rumors of wars. See that he be not troubled. For all these things must come to pass, but the end is not yet. For the nation shall rise against nations, kingdoms against kingdoms, and there shall be famine, pestilence, and earthquake in diverse places. All these are the beginning of sorrow. Matthew 24, 15 declares, When he therefore shall see the abomination of desolation, spoken by the prophet, the by Daniel the prophet. Matthew 24, 29 through to 31 says, Immediately after the tribulation, those days shall the sun be darkened, and the moon shall give her light, and the stars shall fall from the heavens, and the powers of the heavens shall be shaken, and, each, and then shall appear the signs of the Son of Man, my God in the heavens and then shall all the tribes of the earth mourn hallelujah and they shall see the son of man coming in the clouds of the heavens with power and glory and great glory hallelujah and he shall send his angels with the great sound of the trumpet hallelujah and they shall gather together his elect from the four winds from the one end and the heavens to the other hallelujah glory be to God the Lord spoke to me you don't have to to repeat yourself Peter to anyone that the Lord has revealed the secret Sabbath in 2020 when I gave you the word many of the hypocrites and the false brethren and the political activists said that God did not spoke to you today it is proven that God has spoken in all my videos it is revealed of the occult the largest the free ministry the Illuminati the government and the leader of the, this land is a part of that skullhead phenomena the politicians of that region are connected to the large world they are connected to the free ministry I have been telling you this from a very long time from 2020 when God revealed the secret of art hallelujah many of the politicians have connected themselves with the evil some of us false bridging make a big thing out of the St. Thomas scholar fine that's minority to what evil to what e you evil ones are crying about this has been revealed from 2020 March 
the level of evil this government, clergymen and women, top businessmen are a part of. Many of the false prophets and prophetess came out on social media bashing me for the revelation. You don't concern about the body of Christ. First, you would have not taken the COVID blood money two years ago from the government. Many of you have not trusted God. You have trust the, Amer the, 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 the American dollars. Hallelujah. Some of you, you said that you can only make life if you go to America, Sodom and Gomorrah. You can make life right in this land. God can make you prosperous, blessed, and highly favored. Hallelujah. Most of us on social, most of us so-called Christians, believe only if I can go to America to work I can I can only be blessed that's a lie from the pit of hell God can bless you wherever you are when the Lord spoke to me Peter your blessing is not in America or any other country it is in the heavens. also the Lord reminded me of the rumors of war and famine that would my God hit the global world we see gas rising food my God items are right rising light water my God cast a living is going sky high while many of the poor in the land praise God can barely feed their families the strike is just minority what to what is coming to the government and the leader of this land will cause a great upheaval on the high my God Almighty and the high on this, on this land when the truth is being revealed to the Jamaican people there will my God declare Peter we respect you and declare the pastor Andrew Luck was Lacko was right this is the root cause he wanted your head struggles famine drought wars rumors of war is heading to Jamaica and the global world the last biological bilateral talk that the leader had abroad left him worried because trouble is ahead and my cut and loan sum of money he got during the covid has come to an art hallelujah glory be to god here is the word of the lord jamaica food storage my god food shortage is near shortage of food is very near Tough days are ahead. Those who can stock up, start doing it from now. Many will be heading to supermarket and my God, Lord, because of the high prices. I warned you, look to God and not men. They will run out of, of option. The leader of this land keep running out of, out of Jamaica because the COVID money is drying up. Hallelujah. Fiscal struggles are ahead. Economical struggles are ahead. Financial struggles are ahead. My God Almighty. And they are coming. The agriculture sector will be hit severely. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. I told you. And every very one of you came up politically bashing me and saying that I'm political and I'm defending the PNP when I'm defending the people of this land when I look in all that is happening globally and what God is showing me when we looked at the word wisdom which means to have spiritual insight of a thing there is a so-called wisdom that many of the hypocritical and political Christians are talking about uh, the wisdom that what that that caused them to react against the will and purpose of God but we are talking hallelujah about the wisdom of God that gives you spiritual insight the Bible said because of lack of knowledge my people perish if the people are without vision the nation will perish I speak 
to you the leader of this land trouble is ahead financially there is a drought there is a famine coming and there will be my God a large scale of loitering loitering in supermarkets as my God the prices rise look at what is happening in JPS glory be to God that my God the price the light bills are so high the water bills are so high the floor bills are so high and all the governmental sectors are crying out my God for foul play crying out for their money some say they want their partner draw some said that they want their salary look from whence you help come it trust in the Lord my God with all your heart and lean not unto your own understanding in all your ways acknowledge him and he shall direct your Part. Somebody need to look up. It is time to look up. You have put your trust in Andrewness and Mr. Tough Tant. And now you're crying. Now you're protesting. Now you're bawling. You are turning your back against the God that you once knew. The Bible says in the great book, that my God, he made us the head and not the tail, the lender and not the para. Can I get somebody, my God, to trust God? Can I get somebody to lift their faith? Without faith, it is impossible to please God. When the COVID run out, what are you going to do? When the vaccine run out, what are you going to do? People are dying all over. Hallelujah. <laughs>